Users will first click the Live View button to enable the camera's live view to the monitor. The Live View is especially important when shooting a 360 product view as users can pre-rotate their turntable manually to ensure their object is being positioned correctly in the center of the turntable. Next, users can define a pre-crop by clicking and dragging over the Live View window. Users should do so when rotating the turntable to ensure as the object rotates it will not fall outside the crop markers. Users will then want to define a focal point. They can do so through mouse clicks by switching into manual focus mode and clicking the focal adjustment arrows. After the focal point has been set, it will be retained from shot to shot to ensure for consistent focal area. Last, users can make changes to their camera settings to ensure for correct exposure. As you can see, as the camera settings are adjusted, the resulting exposure is simulated in real time in the live view window. Now we are ready to get started shooting. Images are captured by clicking the snap button. Immediately after capture, the images are uploaded to the program. For our next shot, we will simply enable the live view, manually adjust our turntable to the next shooting angle, then press snap again. This will be our standard workflow. Live view, adjust turntable, then snap.